Hey girls, it's Jaren. I have my April Beauty Army box and um, yeah, um, so I've cut the little thing and I opened it and I peeked inside and what I saw was pretty crazy. So um, I got my pink box. Um, it's cute. Ugh, I love Beauty Army. And as I'm starting to pull things out, I'm noticing this weird, like, white stuff all over the box. I don't know if you can see that. And I'm, like, when I was opening it, I was thinking, okay, something, something is up here. It smells funny, and I see white powder all over the box. So I grabbed my little towel, and I opened it up and looked inside, and I don't even know what to say. Um... So I'm just going to make you wait for a second. <laughs> so first of all, it's got the Hello Gorgeous, whatever, has their website. Okay. So, here's the inside of the box. It looks okay, but as you can see, when I swipe my hand across there, you will see all of this white powder everywhere. So, um, when I opened it, this there's like white look at this look see right here you see I don't know if you can see all that it's crazy okay so um weird smell and there's white powder like literally you saw that right <laughs> all over all over all over um here we go. Um, I saw one of my friends, uh, Budika, on here who uh, had the same thing going on that I did. So I got the dry shampoo, and as you can tell, this freaking thing is completely dispensed in my Beauty Army box. This was like the main product I was really looking forward to. Okay, so I open it, and... My dry shampoo by New York Streets that was supposed to be worth hmm, uh, $17.99, the most expensive item in my box and the one I was most excited about. It's missing the lid, okay, and inside is the actual lid, the black nozzle that normally goes on top, and the green little plastic um, thing that goes down in here. Okay, so it's completely demolished and I am seeing that I am at least the second person on YouTube, at least just even that I've seen, that had the same thing happen. So um, I am really anxious to see how many people this happened to. Um, and I know they tried to cram it in the box, you know, the small box and everything, but I mean literally. This is covered in dry shampoo. Um, so this is going to be an interesting unboxing. <laughs> um, okay. Um, this is by Grand Central Beauty and it is a face perfecting polisher. It's worth like 22 cents. Oh my god, it's getting on my clothes. Um... <clears throat> Um, I think it's just like a toner, like a facial toner. Where's my towel? Oh my god. <laughs> okay, um, this, this is like really not good. Okay. Um, and like seriously, even when you wipe it, it's still disgusting. Look. It's like all, like it's all over. Oh my god. Okay. Um, so anyway, this is a facial toner type thing, um, supposed to polish and brighten your skin or something. I don't know. I'm just kind of upset. <laughs> um, okay, so yeah, that's worth like 22 cents. This dry shampoo was supposed to be worth um, like $18. It's completely empty and it's broken. I just, I don't understand. Um, I guess I'm going to try to contact them, but I'm having a feeling I'm probably not going to get a lot of results until like all 100 other people that got this crap contact them. I'm so disappointed because I've been like, you know, having Beauty Army's back since day one. And some people complain about it and I'm like, oh my god, I love them. I love everything. I've never had an issue. And this is my first issue. 
Like, why does this happen? Okay, um, so I got another of the hookup glosses. Here's the little hookup thing. Uh, and I got this once black box that is now white and disgusting. Um, oh, okay. Oh my god, okay. So I got another um, one of the little hookup mascaras. I do like the other one that I have, and I have it actually in the hookup thing. Um, so if I use all that, I can use this to make another one, because I have two of the hookup lip glosses now, and two of the little mascaras, so I can make two um, kind of little touch-up ones. And I do use these. I've kept my other one in my purse, and um, I use it all the time. So, um, yeah. <laughs> There's that. I'm, I'm seriously going to have to wash my hands. Um, and, of course, that's worth six fifty because it's a Mark product, and they always are. Um, I got another one of these Whip Hand Cosmetic Eyeshadows. This one's called um, Locked and Loaded. And I, I don't know if you can even see this. Um, it's like a dark brown. And, like, the label's falling off, and I have a feeling it's because of the dry shampoo because it's got the dry shampoo crap underneath. So, like, the label's even falling off. Okay, so I got another one of those little eyeshadows, and those are worth um, about $2, a little bit over. Oh my gosh, this is gross. Okay, um, then I got this Kotz um, for face. It's like a lotion. <sighs> oh my gosh. Okay, it's like a lotion, um, just a little face lotion. It's got SPF 40, so that's cool. Um, I don't know. Let me know. Off. Oh my god! I'm so disappointed. I so had their back and then they've got to like just throw me to the wolves by doing this crap. Okay, here you can see this better now. Um, so here is the little cots, just a little face lotion. I'm always up for that. And the last thing is these um Oh my god, I'm seeing like white smoke everywhere. Um, these Skin Iceland Hydro Cool Firming Gels. They're these little sticky gels that I guess you put in the freezer or something. And um, you stick it on your skin underneath your eyes to get rid of like puffy eyes or like bags or anything like that. Um, so it's supposed to help firm and de-puff within 10 minutes. And it's just one pair of the eye gels. Um, a full size of this is $30, um, but it comes with eight sets, um, so this is one set, um, and it's worth about $3.75 when you divide that out. So overall, my box is supposed to be worth $32.10, and I was super excited because I thought... You know, I was excited about the dry shampoo. I even have my other dry shampoo that I put in my project pan so that I could get rid of it so I would have room for this new dry shampoo that's supposed to be awesome. And um, yeah, I guess I shouldn't have even done that because uh, this is crap. So I guess I'm gonna email them and um, we'll see what happens. I've had people email them before and um, they said like, I, I've heard of people email them before, and they said, like, they're supposed to get a free product, and I don't think too many people are satisfied with that, because for one, if we didn't want the dry shampoo, we wouldn't have selected the dry shampoo, so we clearly want a replacement, or we wouldn't have selected it in the first place, um... So, you know, I don't know. I'm going to give them a chance because I really don't want to not like them. Like, I really don't. I really do not want to be mad at Beauty Army because this is one of my favorite boxes. And this is just horrible. And I don't even understand. Here's a little eyeshadow again. Okay, here's the thing. Ugh, okay. Let's say I put the lid on here. Okay. Here's the box. And I'm going to get this white stuff all over my table. Okay, so here's my powder cover box here. Okay, look, it doesn't fit in there, clearly. And when they packaged this, someone took the lid off, because this thing barely comes off. Okay, someone took the lid off and put it in the box like so, with the lid off, okay? What do you think is going to happen? And not only did it spill all over my box, it's completely empty, and it 
it ripped the nozzle completely off. So clearly, who who does that? I don't I don't even understand. Um, so my table is covered um, in dry shampoo now, and um, I'm trying to clean these off a little bit. So maybe I can take a decent picture of the items um, that aren't ruined. I think this little face toner is going to be alright because it's in the plastic package and the package, oh my gosh, the package is really the gross part. So I think if I take that out of there, it's going to be just fine. Um, yeah, this is horrible. So <laughs> um, I took a picture of it before I like unbox everything for you guys right now. So I'll upload the atrocious picture. Um, yeah, I don't know. I I know. I know that I am not the only one. I've already seen one of you ladies on YouTube. I've already seen one of you. So, um, and I get my box fairly early because my selection window is at like the end of March. So I get mine like the first week of April for April. So I get my box, you know, really quickly as far as April's concerned. And I just, I know that there are, I know everybody wanted the dry shampoo. It's a full size, huge bottle. That's what everybody like. That was the go to pick for this month. And um, I just, I know that there's got to be like so many more people that have this problem. So um, horrible. I was so excited. And then this like totally ruined my day. So now I've got a mess with trying to contact customer service and waiting on a reply and seeing what they say and seeing if they're going to resolve it. And I really, I really don't have time to mess with all that. I'm, I'm so busy y'all. I just, I don't have time to mess with that. So, um, I, I'm going to shoot them an email and I'm going to shoot them one email and and one email only, and um, I'm hoping it gets rectified because I really, I love Beauty Army, and I'm so disappointed. And like, I use these boxes. I, I'm gonna wipe this box off. I store like jewelry and like rings in these. Like, this thing is so nasty. I don't, I don't. It's probably gonna go in the trash. So, uh, yeah. So, there you go. There's some dry shampoo uh, powder. I'm gonna. Go wash my hands. Okay? Alright. <laughs> Bye.